Unfortunately, I haven't had a workshop to, to work in for quite some time. In fact, I don't really have that big a range of tools to, to work with. I make do with what little I have. And last year, I was able to make that back there. It's a light box for an original vintage Mortal Kombat arcade marquee. Yeah, I'm very happy with that because that's a, that's a legit Aussie one too. I also happen to have the uh, marquees, original marquees for Mortal Kombat 2 and Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3. However, I recently obtained a vintage marquee sign for a game that I think deserves a light box of its own. It's the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles arcade game. Uh, this is the signs that uh, adorned the top of the cabinets here in Australia. So we're going to try and replicate that for the Ninja Turtles. Keep in mind, this isn't a tutorial. Uh, this is less a how-to and more a how I fumbled my way through it. Uh, yeah, looking forward to it. Let's see how I go.
Alrighty, yeah, I am really pleased with myself here. I I reckon I did a bloody fantastic job. Look, I'm aware it's not perfect, uh, but, you know, I'm still very proud of this. One of the things I'm very proud of is the fact that most of this was built out of uh, materials that I had left over from other projects, including the previous light box. The only thing I have left to do now is figure out where to put it. I mean, it's not like I didn't think about that beforehand, it's just I didn't come up with a solution in time, that's all. Ooh.